Welcome back to my channel. So I can't believe it's already coming towards the end of September. It's mad, where's the summer gone? Honestly, I was looking at the calendar today um, and I just couldn't believe it. Could not believe that it's the 20th of September today. It's just mad, absolutely mad. This year is just absolutely fluent. Um, so anyway, here we are again, back for another video, CCL, $651. So I said quite a few videos ago that I was looking at certain stocks. I'd been looking at them for quite a number of months. Um, so you'll see me trading these stocks. Still the futures guy, still doing futures. But I got so many requests just for videos on stocks because I'd been doing futures for such a long time. Obviously you guys need to be stimulated and see other videos. So, and listen, I agree with that as well because it does get boring doing futures all the time, even though I still trade futures all the time. Um, so this is um, another classic setup guys, you, you know my setup by now, you know exactly how, how I approach the market, my simplified approach to the market. Um, so and in terms of the marketplace, it's getting busier now, it's getting much busier, um, much more engagement in the industry in, in general, just because it's, you know, summertime, especially August, it's pretty, um, it's pretty dead to be honest with you. It's really, really dead. Just in terms of the volume, the market itself, the industry, traders taking holidays, a lot of people take a month off. Um, I myself was meant to go away, um, but obviously I'm back now for family reasons. But, um, but yeah, so I would say towards the end of this month, going into next month, you know, the things will definitely be back to normal. We'll have the volume back in the market. We'll have that volatility. And um, my patterns will play out in in, in 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 bigger stages only because of the volatility and the volume that is back in the marketplace. So um, so yeah, so CCL six hundred and fifty one dollars. Um, make sure you guys check me out on Instagram sambora dot zero zero. You can message me as well. Um, and yeah. Um, things are things are progressing nicely now. Students are doing well. Some more students are doing well. It, this this does take time, guys. You know I've said this before. There's no overnight success in the stock market. This takes many many months. And the guys that have been with me now for several months are now starting to see um, consistent profits. Okay, nowhere near where they want to be, but they're seeing them consistent profits, and that's what's important. So I hope you enjoyed this week's video. Make sure you smash that like button. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And I will see you again for more videos. All right, so just having a look at the watch list here. So CCL, so that looks like a good play. My usual setup, nice. So yeah, let's take that. So starting off with 200 lots here. Which is not enough. <laughs> it should have been 2000. Still trying to get used to this new broker. 2000 and 2200 lots, short position. Good. All right. So, reason that I took it, it's ma ma major, major resistance level there. You can see how it's been playing out since basically what five o'clock ish. It just doesn't want to go bullish after the climb of the day. So you've heard me say a hundred times: after the rally, there has to be a pullback. After the sell-off, there has to be a recovery. Okay, so it's a bit of an unusual trade this because normally I would have taken my short position at a much higher price, but I just seen that it was ma making, you know, these major resistance rejections. So I've went in with the 200, should have been <laughs> 2000, should have um, went straight in with 2000, but um, went back in. So I've actually upped it. So went in now with 3,700 lots. Um, why? Because my confidence and where this price is, where it's gone, where it's been, all the usual characteristics, 
support, resistance, price action, momentum, the time of day it is, a lot of different elements. Um, and I'll probably hold this for quite a while. It's the same thing again, usual setups. My setups rarely change. That's the one thing you will see. Um, but what's, what is not clear from looking at some of these videos is why I take um, the entries at a certain price. Like, as I said, normally I would have taken a price much higher. Um, but because of how the stock was playing out, the characteristics, the time that it is in the day, I decided to um, first of all start off with, well it was meant to be 2000 um, put in 200 by mistake, up that, upped it again, so it went in heavy here, 3700 lots, CCL, um, a stock that I've been trading for a very very long time, well over two and a half years now, I think the first time that I traded this stock was April 2019, yeah, April 2019, so I've been trading that stock Bearing in mind, I, I still am the futures guy. I still predominantly trade, trade futures, and um, do trade some of these stocks again. And yeah, you know, I did say a couple of videos ago that I was going to do some more videos on stocks because there's only so many videos that you can make in futures. It gets pretty boring making videos on futures all the time. So I need to mix up a little bit. But I do predominantly still trade futures. I am the futures guy. I've said it. So five hundred dollars. Um, how much more am I going to get out of this now? probably not too much more to be fair I mean, there is a, a lovely bit of a momentum there it's breaking down through them support levels um, but eventually it is going to hit a major support and maybe retrace a little bit which is where I'll take my profit because you can't hold on even though you know the space that's been created since the start of the open at some point it is going to hit a major support level and probably consolidate um, so you've got to take these profits but $577 really happy with that. I'll probably take this profit pretty soon to be fair. I'm not going to wait around. 614 so so yeah. Don't want to push me luck here and get greedy. 688 nearly $700. Well, it's jumped down now. $650. I'll probably take that pretty soon. Yeah, you can see there it's hitting the major support level again. It's been rejected a number of times. Yeah. What does I want to do here? Yeah, probably gonna need to take that. I'll take it, $651.